I absolutely love what I do. I absolutely love it. You know, it's such a cliche, but I honestly, I just don't work a day in my life. I just don't. You know, one of my main goals in life is just to be happy. Back when I was playing rugby league, lucky enough to be contracted to Canterbury Bulldogs straight after school, which is a lot of fun. Kind of got down there though, thought it was everything I wanted and had to reassess, I suppose. I was down there thinking this was everything that I wanted. I worked since I was, you know, I was dreaming about playing professional rugby league since I was nine years old, you know. So to have your top 25 contract on the table, everything there, and to just look at it and be like, this is just not what I want, um, was a really foreign feeling. I, I, because I, I never really thought about anything else. So it was my mother actually said, you know, you love that training side of it, you love working in that team environment, um, why don't you look at doing your fitness uh, certification. So I went to TAFE to get that done. Everything just kind of spun and grew from there. Started my business when I was 19, 20 and just kind of built up, I suppose, to where I am today. Everyone thinks that their culture is the best culture and um, the one thing that I'm super proud of is that whenever somebody comes from another gym to Flux is that they sit here and the first thing they say to me is the vibe. How good are the vibe? How good are the crew? How good are the tribe that you've got there? It's, it's something I worked really, really hard at at the start. You know, your vibe attracts your tribe. I worked really hard to try and get the right people in there. It just organically grows and that's how we create the culture. That's how the culture stays there. In terms of the rebrand, it was it felt good. It felt like the time was right. Yeah, we just went, we just went gun ho on it. When it comes to that, um, you know, internal kind of self doubt, uh, that head talk and that that little voice that comes that comes and creates that self doubt, and I, I always tell that guy to shut up. <laughs> I just, I just, I, I, I like that, you know. And that's how I approach fitness. That's how I approach life, you know. When when that you know doubt starts you know stepping in or creeping into your life, I just I just beat my chest and come get some. I mean it seems to be working so far, so <laughs> we'll just keep winging it. <laughs>